Well, guests to the North Carolina Zoo can watch all kinds of big animals like lions and elephants and alligators in their habitats. They are also having chances to see some small creatures up close through the Animal Ambassador Program. In today's Zoo Files, Shannon Smith introduces us to the newest animal ambassador that will surely be a quick favorite. <laughs> watch Arlo the armadillo scurry around his habitat. His keepers say he's always active. Very. <laughs> He's running around all the time. Once he wakes up, it's he just keeps going. <laughs> the three banded armadillo moved to the North Carolina Zoo earlier this year. He's training to be an animal ambassador. That's a program that allows guests to see some small animals up close. The goal is to teach people about unique species. Most people don't know what they are, so it's nice to be able to have. The three banded armadillos native to South America. When they sense danger, they can roll themselves into a ball to protect themselves. He does have a shell, which is unique for mammals. Um, and then he has these like weird little feet. They're almost like hooves. And he has um, really long like claws in the front to use to dig. Arlo's already had one encounter with a group and of course he was a hit. They loved him. <laughs> He's really cute. It's hard not to enjoy watching him. Staff at the zoo hope many other guests will get a chance to see the small armadillo soon. So that way people can see them and learn about them and maybe figure out ways they can relate and maybe they'll care for them and want to help them out. At the North Carolina Zoo, Shannon Smith, Fox 8 News. So armadillos also live in the southern United States, but it's a different type than Arlo. There are nine banded and much larger armadillos. A few have been spotted in the southern counties of North Carolina, too, in the last few years.